We're about to pay a visit here at the Port McDonald Customs House uh, to find a little bit of history about the building and see if we can get to the bottom of the uh, reported hauntings here. Hauntings? Ah, uh, yeah, it's haunted. It's haunted? Yep. Apparently a woman in period costume appears at the window. I'm not sure if she's playing dress up or if she's actually... So I'm, I'm here with Grant from the Customs House. We've just been having a bit of a wander around um, the, probably the most beautiful building uh, in Port McDonnell. And uh, Grant's with us. So Grant, how long have you lived in Port McDonnell? I've been here all my life. I've been lucky to be yeah. born and bred here. Lived anywhere else? No, this is it, this mate. Is it? This is the luckiest town, right. I reckon. So when you first moved here, you would have known and heard about the, the ghost stories associated well, very much with, so. with the building. So yes. what, do you, what do you know about the ghost stories? I can remember as a kid, we used to go up in the middle of the night and you'd wander over here and I'm sure we heard things, seen things that we... Uh, yeah, right. Yeah. Was it occupied at the time? No, it wasn't actually. Yeah, right. Yeah, no. So they're, they're full of the noises. Yeah, they should Inexplicable. Inexplicable. Inexplicable noises. Well, I've had at least three people mention something about seeing a woman in period costume. Yes, in a wedding at, dress, at a, I believe. You heard, heard anything about it, that? Definitely what, what, heard it. What have you heard? What is the description? The description is at the back of the house here in the, uh, the, the post office area. Yeah. There's a lady standing uh, midway up the window, just peering out, and uh, she's even apparently waved to one lady. She's waved. <laughs> <laughs> one one. Oh, kettle. 